It's Roche Ball. And I, like I said, I was going to be a clown for Halloween. Anyway, happy Halloween night on a Sunday where everybody got to get up and go to work and school the next day. Wow, whatever. But yes, this is my clown outfit. I am boing the clown. As you can see, my last minute touches was I went to get a nose that did not stay on my face. Plus, my mask was down here. So it looked like I've been kissing somebody. But I guess that's the way a clown's lips are supposed to look, huh? But anyway, um, as you can see, I tried to do something with my eyes. I put a little gold and blue and orange, but not so rainbow. I was trying to match this part right here of my costume, the stripes. But um, this is what you get. I'm going to show you guys from a far away how it looks. But I want to make sure I give y'all a really good angle. I know this lighting is not good. But this is the clown outfit that I got from Amazon.com for like $20 plus tax. It was like $22. Or something I took a shower before we went out to trick-or-treating I did tease this wig and this wig um, I think I showed you guys already it's this wig again the red wig is synthetic of course but it's only gonna be for whenever I wear this costume I'm gonna wear this wig okay but I may do something different to my makeup um, maybe hopefully I'll be able to wear this at a party one day um, I, I teased the wig it was straight at first just to give it that messy look because I feel like it would go good I also wore this hat with it as well but it kind of wouldn't stay on. And it's like really, really smashed it on. Let me show you guys. Hold on. Y'all gonna be. Okay. This is how I wore it. I got a couple compliments with of my costume. Somebody told me I was very committed. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is my costume. And um, I'm gonna show you guys the candy that I got. Right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Some pretty good candy choices. I noticed that they give a lot of chocolate more than actual fruit candy. <laughs> try to be in it but I really want to take this wig off y'all saw me bald headed before so it's okay um but yes everybody this is the wig right here it's itchy like I don't know what hi my sister was a cat my oldest nephew was Garth from Wayne's World and my one of my little nephews he was a vampire with blood all over him like he just bit somebody he had blood all on his shirt it was so scary anyway yes I was boing the clown and uh, I had to, I had to take this off. Kind of, I had to put a knot in it because um, it kept getting loose, and I don't want nobody to see my luxury shoulder when I'm walking down the street trick or treating. I don't want to entice these little kids' fathers, you know. That's not me. Um, as you guys can see, I did put on some fake eyelashes because I had eyelashes, but they had cheetah print on them. I thought they were yellow with purple dots. That's why I got them in the first place. You guys are very brave for doing this. Uh, ow! 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 Okay, yeah, I'm going to have to take off the other one with the makeup wipe remover because I'm not trying to lose my eyelid. I do need to close them to go to sleep. So, um, before we went trick-or-treating, we always do like a tradition and go get something to eat. And then we kind of get ready and then we go trick-or-treating. Yes, I'm a 37-year-old person who likes to trick-or-treat. Okay, I did say I was going to use a makeup wipe remover, but I guess I didn't. And that was easy. Um, anyway, you guys, I'm about to head to bed because I got to get up and go to work tomorrow. Luckily, tomorrow's my Friday, so everything should be okay. Look, I got big lips, huh? I can't smile like this. Trick or treat! Y'all, I don't know what be going on with people's Halloween decorations, but somebody had a real life, life-size statue of Jason. I was afraid to pass by because, um, I don't want nobody jumping at me. This ain't Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights. We got to consider that these kids are going to go to bed and have nightmares. You might want to consider that. Um, so, yes, I'm going to take these off. And I don't want to lose these eyelashes. I'm going to wash them and wear them again. I know it's not human hair, but it's what I got to do. Um, I did save some of the plastic to put my um, outfit back in, my wig and my hat, until I find a garment bag. Because I'm going to save all my costumes in case... Let's just say I don't have any money to get a new one or I decided let me revamp this one. Let me go ahead and do that. And I'll just go ahead and just recycle the um, costume. Why not? Um, <clears throat> so I have my Freddy Krueger one. I have a black jumpsuit. I need to get some more angel wings. No, no, butterfly wings because um, I was a butterfly and with the little antennas. I would like to also get a garment bag for all of my costumes so that way I can save them and I can you know wear them from other times or if so I don't have a costume in my family I'll say you want to you want to be a clown I don't think I'm gonna share the Freddy Krueger one ever because that would be like sharing your man with another woman and I'm not doing that so um yeah 
So let me go ahead and take this off because I have a this bodysuit underneath. You know what? Let me just show you guys um, while I talk to you guys. You guys won't be in good lighting. But um, you guys have to do with it. My cousin and his daughter and his son, they were Chucky and Tiffany for Halloween from the Bride of Chucky. Um, I'm sorry, but honestly, and I have to say this, after Child's Play 2, it's kind of where it stopped for me. The third one was okay, but that little black boy was getting on my damn nerves. So Chucky needs to kill you real quick, shoot. No, but then I'll be wrong for, you know, me encouraging Chucky to kill this poor innocent black boy who just wanted to play with him. You know what? I uh, also got these fishnet. Just today, I got the red nose and these fishnet gloves. As I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by accidentally pushing the stop button. Anyway, I got these fishnet gloves today at the last minute. Um, it was either these or white gloves, but I wanted to show my nails off. And somebody said, wow, look at those nails or something like that. And, you know, I just have to go all out for Halloween. Um, as far as that prom party, I don't think I'm going to go. But um, I had fun tonight. <laughs> and I got lots and lots of candy. So I'm going to go ahead and take this knot off. I'm just wearing this, and this is a whole jumpsuit all the way down to my ankle. Okay, you guys. Today is going to be a chilling, chilling, I'm trying not to use the word lazy, but today is going to be a chill, lazy day. I got cut off last night from recording because my phone decided to die. First it told me my time limit to record is, is, is you know, it succeeded. And then I record again because I had to get rid of a lot of stuff on my phone, like old pictures and big files and stuff, just to have room to do this. And, um... So I recorded again the second half of the video, and then all of a sudden it just died on me. So I had to charge my phone, which is fully charged right now. Um, it is, yeah, 86%, but I, it's fully charged, whatever. Um, the point is, um, so today I'm going to just chill in a room, not really do much, do my hair later on. i got to wash my hair, I'm going to let it air dry, and I'm going to start braiding my hair, like, probably, like, when everybody is sleeping. And then I'm going to go to bed, and then I'm going to get up early, and finish braiding my hair so i want to be finished braiding my hair tomorrow even if it's all day because i don't want to be doing this on wednesday okay um so that was my video that was my costume i was a clown and i've always wanted to be a clown i think i've already told you guys the story of how the clown me wanting to be a clown for halloween came about you know i watched halloween 4 saw danielle harris who played jamie in halloween 4 she wore a clown outfit and ever since then i wanted to be a clown for halloween didn't get a chance to do it um but now i decided to be true to wanting to be a clown and i was very committed with it that's why you see so much red on my lips because i made my lips super big um and i wanted to look as friendly as possible because i know there's some people out there who may still be afraid of clowns so when i was trick-or-treating i went to one door and they said she said that um clowns give her the the creeps or the heebie-jeebies or something like that and, I, and she was like but you're very you're very you're a cute, you're a cute clown. I don't want. I wanted to make sure I wasn't a scary one because that would really traumatize people. Light bulb, ding. I don't know. Um, it's a question I asked myself early this morning. So people are afraid of clowns, but not so much aliens. Whatever, but um, because I think they exist among us. But anyway, so let me go ahead and in this video by saying i'm gonna order me a cob salad from denny's get my entirety life with the salad i'm gonna try my best to eat good today and drink water and smirnoff and jim bean but and, and you know because no 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 smirnoff is my friend we call her smirnoff because she's always drinking it and jim bean is just this guy that just like to hang out with us you know family friend you know it's not it's not that you know but anyway, you guys, um, thank you so much for subscribing and watching my videos. Yes, I slept with this beanie on when I went back to sleep this morning. My hair is a mess. I still don't think, oh yeah, let me just say this for the record. When they, Around the time when everybody was talking about women shouldn't wear bonnets out in public, I also don't think that women should go to the beauty supply place to get some supplies to do their hair looking like I don't know what. Just because you're about to get your hair done does not mean you get to walk around looking like my niece, my witness. You don't need to walk around with your hair 
messed up. Now, this may be acceptable, the beanie thing, but I'm not about to go to a beauty supply place like this telling someone well, I'm about to do my hair anyway. So, just as much as women should not be wearing bonnets in public, don't go to the hair supply with your hair like this. I'm just saying, that's embarrassing too. Who cares if you're about to do your hair? Still take a little bit more pride in yourself. Put on a beanie, put on a hat, a lazy ponytail underneath, or whatever. I'm just saying, because I see a lot of that when I go to the beauty supply. And a lot of scarves, and which I think is okay, but um, most of the time people be just ready to braid their hair. So I be standing in front of people and people be behind me in line with packs of hair. Either they're going to do somebody's hair or they're going to do their own. I don't know. But anyway, you guys, I just feel that way. I had to add that in there a little bit because that's embarrassing for women to be just like me. Do my hair like this in front of the world. I'm sure you guys are tired of seeing me with my hair sticking up all over the place on my channel. So let me just go ahead and do something about myself before I talk about what? Somebody else. So hold on. Okay. That little dab will do me. Anyway, so yeah, I just thought I'd share that. Um, even though this ain't no different, me showing you guys and all the times I've got on my video showing you guys my hair so that i'm preaching to myself too so please don't think i'm a hypocrite like that i'll come on here and show everybody who watches my videos how my hair be sometimes i need to kind of like take my own advice i'm one of those people i'm not gonna tell y'all something if i'm not doing it i'm not gonna tell y'all to do something if i ain't doing it i ain't gonna tell y'all stop doing something if i'm still doing it that's just me because i don't like when people do that so i don't want to be that person so let me just put this back on and shut the hell up about it and just say thank y'all so much for watching my videos See y'all in the next one.